and welcome to the episode of May Contain. I'm Soaps. And I'm Gander. And today we are brought to you by and sponsored by the Ace of Adelaide. That's right. And this guy is awesome. Check out some of his pictures now, guys. We're going to throw them up on screen. Yeah. Uh, this is him doing, oh, Gollum. You got Gollum. Yeah. You've got, uh, yeah, the Tim Burton franchise, not the actual film, but the, the Riddler. Yeah. Jim Carrey's Riddler. Brilliant. He even does uh, Ezio. Ezio from, from Assassin's Creed. Assassin's Creed. So go check him out. Uh, we've got it up his, his Facebook. Go give him a like, a tick, a tick of approval, a thumbs up. That's it. Or a heart now. And you know what? If you ever see him around the cons because he travels around to Oz Comic Con, yep. Supernova, give him a hug. Give him a hug. Right? He would love that. High five hug. That's it. <laughs> Bring it on. So we've got big news to talk about. Yes. Something, uh, talking about like uh, praising someone. That's it. Uh, praising our sponsors. Let's praise the movie industry as a whole. Yes. Let's talk about the Oscars. Yeah, because we haven't spoken about the Oscars yet, have we? No. Leo. So, finally. Straight into it. Look at that, Leo. <laughs> Leonardo DiCaprio has well, finally won he's Best got Actor. It. He's got it. So, uh, first of all, lots of controversy over the Oscars in general. Yes. Uh, a lot of... Uh, people boycotting it and things like that. I know Will Smith decided not to show up. Yeah. Do you know what? It's the first one I ever actually watched. Oh, you're the whole thing? Yeah. The first yeah. one I've ever watched. I reckon because of the whole Leo hype. Yeah, you said, oh, give him a, I'll, yeah. I'll check him out. But yeah. it had all this controversy behind it, like you were saying. Yeah, so. So, so the controversy is that there was no black actors nominated second year in a row. Yeah, second apparently. year running. None. Yeah. yeah. And th- this is, once again, I haven't watched the whole thing, so don't say, oh, but so-and-so's nominated. All I know is that they're pissed off. Yes. Um, yet, the host yes. was black. Chris Rock. Yes. Yes. So, that's true. That is yeah. So, so is that a compensation, you reckon? Like, No, not at all. Like, no, look over things- this way, guys. Like that, and then... I think um, talking about it uh, just as a whole, yeah. almost, uh, it's one of the things that doesn't need to be mentioned. One okay. of those things, I feel it's kind of like you're bringing up uh, a racial thing yeah. by mentioning it. Oh, but I'm, so, I'm, I'm just... Oh, no, you no, mentioned no. in the Oscars in, in, in general. Yeah, in yeah. general. Like, yeah. That's what I'm saying. Like People having an uproar about it, right? Yeah. Going, there was no black people in it and stuff like that. Yeah. Well, I'm, I'm sorry. Like, that's... that's it's, it's, I don't it's, see that as being a racial thing. I just see that as being a people thing. It happens to be that way. And we're looking for the best actor. Now, I remember when there was an uproar when it's, oh, but we're looking for actress... But we're just an actor. Yeah. We're the same fit. And they didn't want the whole male and the whole female thing. They wanted to be on the same page. Yeah. Then why have an uproar over this? Yeah, it's no different. That's it's, ex- it's, and that's exactly what I'm saying. If it's yeah. not if it's not racial, it's gender. And yeah. that, and that's yep. and they've they've still got the same categories for um, you know, male and female act. But yeah. it would be weird as hell yeah. if you went we're gonna have a white and a black winning. Like Yeah, it would be stupid. Yeah, and that's what I'm saying. So you, you, you can't really do both. I'm sure, like, and I'm sure there's some years when, like, Will Smith did Ali and things like that. Yeah, that that it was majority of black people. I don't remember anyone going. I don't remember anyone standing up going, "I'm not going." But any other film that's uh, like Once a Slave, right? yeah, yeah, which is like it's world renowned. That's yeah. a huge film and stuff like awesome that. Awesome movie, right? And there's a very good chance that um, obviously uh, the movie Race is just yes. coming out now as well. And if that doesn't get some sort of nomination from something... People will go crazy. I reckon that. And that's a film that yeah. is, is definitely up and coming to be in that same category. Yeah. Just because it didn't happen uh, this year for this Oscars. Yeah. Because you have stuff like The Martian, Spotlight. Oh, The Martian. Um, best and, movie that I've personally seen last yeah, year. Um, all those it. ones and stuff like that. Yeah. Uh, like Matt Damon or whatever. Matt Damon! <laughs> yeah. Um, again, yeah, this just happened to be the roles that they're in. Now, talking about... Some of the awards yes. that took place, because to be honest, I watched some of it. I watched yeah. about half of it and I skipped to Leo, as you do, as you do. But I was unaware of some of the actual awards that they get, and so, some are deserved, and yeah. some aren't. That, that they're not good, not worthy, not worthy. Like, okay, and my wife and me talked about this, yes. right? The award for getting someone's material and then turning that into a script. But that's an award. That's an award, yeah. So it's it's adaption from like book. source material. So like I think. A, so yeah. it's book to film. Yeah, something like that. So so book to film, it could be um, in theory book to script because it was literally script writing it. Yes. Um, it could be from a short movie to that stretching it out to make a feature long film. Mm. It could be anything like that. And like, do do you honestly feel that they're des- like because the the work's done? Do you know what? Yes, absolutely. Really? No. Yes. No. Do you know why? 
Because you know what? If everyone um, actually had someone, I'm not going to take this from comic book writing. This is why yeah, you never this see. Is... This is why you never see a comic book film at the Oscars. Okay, why? Right? Why is that? Because they're not deserving of that award anyway. Because you know what? I went. And everyone, you haven't seen Deadpool yet. Yeah. But everyone I was speaking to, they're like, "Oh, it's exactly taken from the comics." Yeah. Oh. Uh, no, no, it's not. Yeah, okay, right, because they can't. So they can't take. No, it exactly. that's what I'm saying. So that's why I don't feel you can take that from a source material. Yeah, you can make the character the same. Great, but yeah, from a book perspective. Yeah, so something like Hunger Games or your, your tween books. So you, Harry Potter well deserved, like that, you think? Yeah, I reckon something like that. Like when someone did, uh, well, I won't say someone. When yeah. Peter Jackson did the Lord of the Rings. Yeah, um, there was things taken out, added in, whatever mixed around. Yeah, and that's why I don't feel. Like everyone was like, oh, the book is still so much better. Yeah, it has to be. So longer. when I reckon that you you can be appraised for, you've nailed the book. Like that's exactly what the book's like. Yeah, but they're, they're, I'm talking they're up there, right alongside original material stuff. Yeah, like they're not in the same. Do you feel realm. Do you feel they're clutching at straws for a four awards? Well, I just feel like it's it's almost like. Yeah, it's, it's like, okay, they're, they're going to remake. What movie won an Oscar back in the day? Let's talk about friggin... Titanic. Titanic. Okay, won an Oscar. Okay, so James Cameron sits in a little room and he's like, I'm going to make a sequel to Titanic. They did. No, they didn't. Yes, they did. They made a sequel There's to a Titanic. Se- there is a sequel to Titanic. Set in space. It's, no. It's no? Like, no, they made a Titanic 2, a second ship. Sorry, I'll, can, okay. we'll get to that another time. Okay. <laughs> But do, but do you get what I mean? Like, so, as in, what they're doing is they're grabbing and they go, this won it. Like, I know for a long time that if it was just one person and he lost a lot of weight because of, I think, um, Tom Hanks did it for Castaway. Yeah. Then Christian Bale did it for something else. Like, a lot of people go, that's how you get nominated. Yeah. But, so all actors started going, I need to find a role here. I need whatever. to get sick real I need quick. To, yeah, exactly. <laughs> And, and and then that's it. Like Leo, how many years has he tried and he's worked and he's pushed and he's never got it? Yeah. He grows a beard and they give it to him. I reckon it's a bit more than that. He grew a beard and they've given it to him. Also, uh, Leonardo DiCaprio is a very well-known vegetarian. Oh, right? okay. And he actually ate a lot of raw meat for the Revenant. <laughs> that's fine. He's an actor. He didn't eat it. So- <laughs> <laughs> he's characterated. He's characterated. He's, it's fine. <laughs> Something like that, I feel, is pushing beyond his limits I don't, or his I, own moral things. Yeah, but I, I that that is the exact same guy thing. Yes. Now, what you're saying right there, Leo wants to eat meat. What? He's taken roles to eat meat. You reckon that's? I it? reckon that's it. It's the same with the porn actors. Oh, I love my wife. It's just part of the role, mate. I just, <laughs> I have to do this. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, and they're saying it as they're getting undressed because they they're ready. It's, it's not me, it's the character. I'm paying Sven the, spo- the, the pool guy. So what, you're saying he's not deserving of the award? Who, Leo? Yeah. I am, but I don't think for... Because that's so... He went out of his comfort zone. So if you're going to give the Oscar to any of the nominees this year... Yeah. Who should have got it? Rocky Balboa. He Sylvester wasn't in Stallone. the nomination. He was nominated, wasn't he? <laughs> Support- it was supporting. supporting. I, you for know what? Actor. Let's get rid of supporting. Why? Because we don't need that. Yeah. You can be a best actor behind the main cast. Right. We don't need... You know what? There should just be two awards. What's that? Yeah. Looking good. Looking good. Who's more... Po- oh, th- now, more- do you realise we... Yeah, you can continue. It's just something you just did. But yeah, yeah. yeah. Looking good. Yeah. And uh, who's the most popular? <laughs> so it's going to say award every year. Every year. Leo's back now. Now, something you just Woo! did... Now, something you just did then, yeah. right? Yeah, what? Is also something that came up at the Oscars when Leo accepted his award. What? Right? So, when he actually went up and he grabbed his... Uh, they, so they give you the, the actual... Uh, the award and they yeah. give you the... Uh, like a little envelope that goes with it. Okay, yeah. Right? So, he grabbed his envelope. Yeah. Right? And what I just realised is when you were counting... Okay. Like this. Right? So, he got the envelope... Okay. Yeah, yeah, no, he got it like this. Yeah. Oh! Right? So, he's standing up on stage like this. Right. So, right. so all these pictures have come out now. With him like of him yeah. flipping off the audience. Oh. Hey, so, I've got another fun fact. Yes. Okay. You're up on stage, you've won the Oscar. Good work, mate! You've won it! Yes. The Oscar you have, yeah. not engraved. Right. Okay, so, so you blank then, Oscar. It's a blank Oscar. It's anybody's because they want to keep it exciting. The only person that knows is that little envelope. Yep. Okay. So anyway, Leo's got it, it's blank. They come down those little stairs and they go off to left or right. Yep. There's engravers yep. set up. They're engraving stuff. Yep. 
Lots of press there, taking pictures, taking yep. photos. Leo went over there, got his Oscar engraved. Now, it takes a little bit of time for them to actually engrave it. Well, yeah, they've got to do it professionally. Probably, yeah, you yes. don't want to spell DiCaprio wrong. Imagine yeah. that, poor bugger. Oh, my God, remember yeah. that. Well, you just flick the plate out and get another one. Yeah, give me it's it not actually, It's not actually on the... Uh, no, no, they, they do the plate and then they pop it on, okay? Yeah. So, anyway, Leo thinks, I'm going to have small talk yeah. to the lady doing the engraving. So, he said to her, do you guys do this every year? Slight pause, because I wouldn't know. Because he's never won an Oscar before. And that was his little stab. Fair enough. Yeah, I thought it was funny. But here's another one that I've got. Just, yeah. you know, here's my stab at yeah. the Oscars. At the right? Oscars, yes. Is how can a film yes. right, win so many awards yeah. and then not win Best Picture? Because it's not the Best Picture. Now, you know what I'm talking about. Uh, right? You are talking about Maximum Mad Max. Yes, Mad Max. Right? Mad Max to the Max Max Max. Which cleaned up at the uh, cleaned up at the Oscars. At the Oscars. Best, yeah. best costume design, best... Yeah. Everything. Right? Yep. Person oh, accepting the awards. Why didn't you wear a dress? Yep. What? That, that was one of the controversies. <laughs> really? The the set the the costume lady. Yeah. That won the award for because they won best costumes. Yeah. Because it looked awesome. Yeah. She was not in a frock. Yeah. Leather jacket, skull on the back, just got up in jeans, walked up to the top. Yep. Thanks. We watched the same Oscars. I must have missed all. You missed that. <laughs> bit. Yeah. She won the award. So I believe she won it. But again. How yeah. do they win all these awards? Yeah. Best director. Yeah. You think if best director wins, right, yeah. you would have a best picture. No. No. Two S- different things. No, Spotlight wins. Spotlight, right? was, it looks good. I haven't seen it. Spotlight probably deserves it, right? Yeah. I haven't seen it yet. Yeah. But yeah, you look at something that wins all these awards, yeah. and then something else wins it. It just seems like a bit of a shock. Yeah. So. Because cause what? I just want to know where they draw the line. Like, where do they go... All right, you've, you've done all of this. Yeah. You've won everything, right? Yeah. But you just didn't get there, and this one was better than you. But who chooses? Who chooses the winner? I don't oh, get a say. It's critics. Like, it it's is just, critics. So like it comes down aca- to critics. Academy critics. Okay. So, mm-hmm. what what I'm saying right now mm-hmm. is they need to start introducing new categories. <laughs> right. Okay. I, I still agree with best set design. Yeah. Best costumes. Yeah. Best actor. All that. I'm yeah, not going to yeah, try yeah. and get rid of all that. Maybe supporting actor. Get out. Oh, so, um, so no win for Sly. Okay. Oh, no, he's best actor because it, so, it's not supporting. He acted in that uh, role. It's just best actor. Yeah. Right. But they should also add in because there's obviously best editing and things like that. Yes. Best trailer. Do you know what? Don't worry about if the movie's good or bad. Yeah. I reckon. I reckon best trailer. Yeah. Is a definite. They need to put it in, don't they? You know what? Because then something like. There's so many poor trailers out there that ruin films now. Yes. Yeah. That you, yeah, you need best trailer. Yeah. I, th- I think that needs to be in there. So because it, it, it and, and that is a master craft. Even if the movie is completely shit. Yeah. That's even more credit to the editor that made that trailer look good. It's the same editors that edit the film. Is it so, really though? So yeah, it's the same. So oh, okay. for for most films, um, the person who actually edits the film. Yep. They've got all the content there. They're the ones that make the trailer. Wow, right. okay, I did not know that Yeah, at all. true. Yeah. And so what they end up doing, so they'll get... So if, even if it comes... If they win Best Editing or something yeah. like that, yeah. it might be for a trailer. I, yeah. I don't know how they I don't know how they do that. All yeah. I know is whoever edits the trailers yeah. edits the films. Yeah, wow. So. And, and, and pick some better music to kick someone off stage from their speech. So it's not just Guys and Dolls anymore. It's, um, they played, it's, it's like... They played oh, a whole... Oh, so I don't know what it is. It's orchestral like, music. Yeah, Move on. Why? They need a band, right? A live band. There is a live band. Oh, is that them actually doing yeah, it? Yeah, under the stage. They're under the stage? Yeah, they introduce them. Like, they bring them really? up at the end. It shows how much I watch. So, Did they get an award? So, no. No? So No, they're just there. Yeah. So, they enjoy it. The, uh, one of the best things that I love doing at the Oscar, like, watching... I, I haven't attended, but watching the... <laughs> not yet. Not yet. So... Nominees. Watching the Oscars yep. is just watching when they cut to just other random celebrities in the cr- in the crowd. Um, reactions and just reactions. Like I saw um, uh, Spider Man, original Spider Man. What's his name? Toby Maguire. Toby Maguire in the crowd, like when when Leo won, mm. and he was like, "Yeah, I can't wait now." Like in his mind, all he's thinking is after party, after I, party. I think so. Because <laughs> that's all they want. They want to go get hammered. I think I think half of them are already hammered when they're sitting there. Yeah, but um. No, I love, I love the reactions. I remember watching the uh, the Emmys and stuff like that, Golden yeah. Globes, when Ricky Gervais is um, hosting. Oh, yes, and brilliant. He, oh, brilliant like, host. 
such a good host, like, hardly offensive, right? Yeah, but, but that's hard. Aren't, but, we, aren't they all but now? Cu- always cutting to, like, those, you know, the celebrities, and you get those everyday moments out of them oh, just, where you just watch them just break down in laughter going, that is not, that's not politically correct. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. And it's even when they show that, like, the actor, like, Brian Cranston, what's his name? Cranston? Bro- yeah, Brian Cranston. They showed him for the the one where he's the writer. I can't yeah. remember the actual name. Yeah. A, a Pody or something like that. Yeah. So anyway, he's in the bath and he's doing it. And then obviously it cuts to his face straight after the clip. And he looks yeah. in the camera and he's like... Yeah. <laughs> like, kind of like, well, <laughs> that's me, guys. That's what they asked me that's, to do. That's what they are. I did that. So, but, yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I, I think they need to add more categories. Um, they need to make it more fun. They need to show us. Who cares? Just show us the highlights and then show us the after party when all the celebrities make out. <laughs> yes, the after party would be a great one to watch. Yeah, it would be brilliant. They're having awards for the after party. It's like when they used to have Big Brother and then Big Brother Uncut. Yeah. So you have the Oscars and you have the Oscars Uncut. Yes, so, it would be brilliant. Yeah. Can, can you imagine the stuff that would happen? And that's why celebrities, celebrities hook up there. It, was never, it would never be They brilliant. hook up. They tongue wang. <laughs> they swivel their dubble. <laughs> Uh, they do it all. That's I, I'm pretty sure that's where Orlando Bloom met um, Miranda Kerr. No, that's that's done now. It's Katy Perry now. Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh, I can't keep up with their level. It's Katy Perry. <laughs> so, I can't even keep up with like my own, let alone theirs. No, that's, that's where so, Tom Cruise met Katie Holmes. So, <laughs> it's all this stuff, people. It's, it's the best place to get two celebrity names put together. You reckon? Yeah. All right. We'll sort that out. So we'll have to wait for the next Oscars. Yeah. So well, we might we might find out what what snuck in here. I don't. Is Leo yeah. with someone? Is he married? I don't even know. I don't know. You know why? He's not. He's not that attractive. True. Let's move on. <laughs> Give Tom Cruise an award. Give him an Oscar for what? For something that he's about to do. <laughs> Mission Impossible. He could get one for stunts. Stunts. So best stunt. Best actor doing his own stunts. Because that's another thing that's not mentioned at the Oscars as well. Stunts aren't mentioned at the Oscar. No. But stunts have their own award night. Yeah. So yeah, which is pretty cool. And they come through the walls and stuff like that to receive their awards. That would be awesome to see. It's wicked to watch. Yeah. So I want to see that. I even want to see the the, the raspberries. Yeah. Yeah. The, the worst Razzies. of the worst. Yeah. Because yeah. I love it when the actors actually show up, like Halle Berry did for Catwoman. Yeah, she over, actually showed over, up. Overdid it. With a... Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Um. All right, guys. I guess I guess that sums it up. Yeah, yeah. I think I think that was a pretty damn good episode talking about the Oscars. Yeah, true. We needed to. Had to get it out of the way. Yeah, guys, nominate us. Yeah, we, we won't probably won't probably win, but nominate yeah. us anyway. Yeah, and don't play that. Turn that music down right now. We're still talking. <laughs> I hate when they do that, guys. I hate it. Awesome, guys. Well, thank you very much for tuning into another episode. Uh, please like, subscribe, share, comment, buy, purchase, or just. Plain stalk in the street. Us. That's it. (laughs) I'm Gander. I'm Soaps. See you later, guys. See you, guys.